At six o'clock, Northern Virginia Health District is scrambling tonight. A spokeswoman says two staffers have tested positive for coronavirus and several more have had to self quarantine. The Rappahannock Health District, which covers Stafford, Fredericksburg, Spotsylvania, and the Northern Neck, has had to temporarily close several clinics right now in the middle of this pandemic. Bruce Lachan starts us off tonight in Fredericksburg. The Fredericksburg Health Department building is closed right now for a deep cleaning, as are the Stafford and Spotsylvania Health Department buildings, according to a spokeswoman. The spokeswoman says that first a nurse tested positive for coronavirus and then a front office staffer. Both are at home now, but the spokeswoman says they are struggling with COVID-19 symptoms. Workers are tracing all their patient and staff contacts, the spokeswoman says, and letting everybody know if they too need to self-quarantine. So far, 18 other staffers have had to isolate themselves. That's a lot. It is. Is this hurting your fight against COVID-19? Fortunately, a lot of that can continue to take place uh, from home. But the Rappahannock Health District has had to shut down temporarily in-person clinics for things like maternal health and childhood vaccinations. We give a lot of immunizations. Last year, we gave over 9,000 immunizations, but we've put a complete pause on that at least for the next two weeks. It is really critical that kids get immunized even now. Yes, absolutely. We don't want to trade one outbreak for another outbreak. Right now, the Rappahannock Health District has a total of about 90 staffers and 20 of them are now in self-quarantine. About half of the total staffers have been working on the battle against coronavirus. So this really has been a challenge. In Fredericksburg, Bruce Lachey and WUSA 9. The sp a spokeswoman says the nurse who tested positive had been working in a clinic just last week, but says she was wearing an N95 mask with a cloth mask over it.